Well, at 6, the water is back on for people in West Lauderdale County. West Lauderdale Water Authority says its crews had to turn off the water to allow tanks to refill earlier today. Wayne Thady Wentz, Maddie McCaffrey joins us live from Lauderdale County with more on the situation. Nicole, people who live in West Lauderdale County, they were without water for more than eight hours today. And we just got word that the water is now back on after crews spent all day refilling up the tank. I spoke with the chairman of the Lauderdale County Commission, Danny Pettis. He says he's been speaking with water departments all over the county. He explained a bit of the West Lauderdale County situation people are seeing. Their levels really went down in one of the tanks. Uh, I think they had to turn off from the trace up to the Tennessee state line. Uh, that should be, once they fill that tank back up, then they should be able to have water on late in the afternoon. And Pettis says what might have caused the water tank to drop so low is an increased use of water and busted pipes from the freezing conditions that people may have been unaware of. Uh, I've talked to uh, all four county water departments, and all of them are wanting people to not only conserve water, but to, if they can, safely get to their meter have all the water shut off and get to the meter and see is the little triangle thing moving pretty fast. If it is, that probably means they have a leak and a busted pipe somewhere. But just to, they just want people conserving water is number one. And Pettis recommends everyone in Lauderdale County to try and conserve water. As Taylor mentioned, definitely try to drip your faucets once the temperatures drop below freezing again. Reporting live in Lauderdale County with coverage you can count on, Maddie McCaffrey, Way 31 News.